Welcome back, one and all. My name is Anthony, this is XCOM 2 with Shen's Last Gift and Alien Hunters DLC. We have a grill off to go on, and the those among you who are paying attention will notice that we're not going to the new Arctic and we're not getting the intel. It's because my save was apparently right before this. It was an auto save right before this instead of right after it. I wasn't paying enough attention and I forgot to do a hard save. Uh, and so when the grill ops popped up, they're different. Um, lame. But not a big deal, I guess. We're going to get supplies instead. We're still going to counter the hidden event. And uh, our mission this time will be protect the device instead of uh, hacking a thing on a train. I kind of would rather have done the hack on a train because I might have been able to get some more enemy protocols for my specialist. But it is what it is, I guess. So we're going to protect the device. Moderate. We get a bunch. Of I mean, the supplies are welcome too. Don't get me wrong. Setting course for East Asia. Commander Tigan and Shen aren't going to be happy if we don't put the Skulljack to good use. We should have one of our soldiers equip it before they deploy. That would be our officer. Alright. Spark gets to go along with us. Um, it would have been nice to get another one built so I can start training it up, but we are short on stuff, so there's that. Grenades, sniper rifles, Grenades. Shotguns. Brilliant. Looks pretty solid. I think all of our gear is still pretty much equipped from last time, so let's roll. Sky Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy. Hacker working for the Resistance installed a data tap along the Advent network in this area, and the data they're retrieving is critical to the aliens' latest operation. Recon suggests the aliens are already moving to destroy the device. That data is too valuable to lose, so we're moving in to secure the area, eliminate all hostile contacts, and protect that gear. You got it. Protecting the device missions are usually pretty easy, because the device has a lot of health. Um, but you can't kind of look uh, lollygag around too much, you really do need to move, especially in these later missions, where the aliens are doing more damage per hit. Forces are already moving to destroy the data tap installed nearby. We need to lock down the area and secure the device at all costs. Well, it looks like it's going to be a bit of a run. Probably going to want to try to get on top of this building and then uh, see where that puts us, I guess. Ranger, Ranger, Ranger. Okay. Scanner tower? Scanner tower. Good copy. Moving on target. Why do they always end up being on the flank like that? Now I get terrified they're going to walk into me. They'd have to move a fair bit. Monitoring for activity. Grappling! Or I could just go hot right away. If I hit them, they'll probably move in. The problem is, they'll probably move in enough to reveal my ranger. I don't know if I can get people close enough to really deal with it. Moving out. I think we may try, though. That's affirmative. 
Moving to position. Got it covered. A couple grenades to try to clean up the end, and here we go. 95, he could conceivably dodge, which, unless they, you know, did they ever change that? I can't remember. I kind of ranted along uh, as we've been playing that if you're concealed, that they shouldn't be able to dodge if they're unaware of you. I don't know if they ever fixed that or not, or changed it. Well, he didn't dodge, so minimum damage, which is annoying. They're on to us! Here we go. It's not the start I was looking for. Oh, range is totally revealed. Target diagnostic required. I guardian a bit. Shot wide. They see me. Yeah, this might have been a bad idea. Well, that civilian's dumb. We'll just do this early to. Uh, Try to make sure that we're safe. Just can't quite get it to that uh, snake. So I'll just take a shot at 51%. Sounds about right. It's still moving! Pretty sure that was the Berserker Queen. Uh, okay. They hit their own person. All right. You know, now that they changed it to where the mimic beacon can't be missed, like it's a guaranteed hit. I kind of wish there was ways that you could. Uh, well, obviously, except for the grab, because. You can't grab the hologram. Um, but I kind of wish there was a way to beef it up a bit. Oh dear. There's more stuff back there. Now, hey, come on. Oh, that's just rude. All the pods are getting activity back there. It's because of the ruler. It's messing things up and confusing the game. Uh, aren't you? Yeah, you're actually there. All right. Heading to that location. Heading out. Okay, snake. Get ready for a surprise. Oh, there's a civilian there. Oh well. If you're too dumb to get out of the combat area. No! I'm not, not, no! I'm just helping the gene pool. I have a hundred against you. Oh, because you're st all that it didn't blow up your cover. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Well, I have a stock, so I can do two damage against you. You are not in squad sight range. So, okay. On approach. Uh, 
I hate Archons. I hate them so much. They have, like, this just incredible freaking defense that's just like, oh, by the way, you can't hit me. Even though you're standing right next to me and you place the barrel of your rifle against my chest, you're still gonna miss. 25 defense. And they can dodge too, so if you do manage to hit them, you do like half damage. It's it's superb. Fortunately you have 100% so you can't dodge this. Yeah, that's right. What did you expect? Hey loot. This might be useful. Advanced scope, yeah, I'll take that. The death from above, only 83, that's unfortunate. Well, one. Should be enough. Because even the miss with the advanced stock. Oh, well, it was a hit. So dodge, but you're dead. Alright. Scanning. I have no idea what, why are you hitting are, are you enraged? Well, I should just kinda let you do this. Uh what was that? Were you stabbing the I don't know what you're doing. I don't want to just keep letting him hit things. Just a moment. Or I can just hit you with a rocket. Safe than sorry. Oh, have you stopped uh, killing your own people? Okay, a little confused. Actually, kind of a lot confused, but it did hurt its own people, so. Let's make sure to take it out this time. Do what we can. Dead Eye 86. I'd rather get a kill from above with you right now so that I can...
position. exactly she planned on doing with this thing. I would be curious to hear her reasoning, although I would question whether reason was ever involved in this decision. Yeah, I'd agree with that. Valen never had a lot of what you might call restraint. On the move! Starting to come through a little bit better for me. Yep. Take a fire over here. Oh, come on, he's not in the acid. Salvo. <laughs> that was your turn to be awesome. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. 
Okay, so Spark got a, a tiny bit beat up again. I kind of feel like that may be more and more common as we go through. Since I start to kind of depend on that armor and, and whatnot. And the Berserker Queen is down, so win there. I'm also not entirely sure why the Berserker Queen was attacking her own people back there, but I'm not going to say no to it. Berserkers do have that tendency occasionally to attack their own troops, so it must be something similar. I'm glad to see our new recruits aren't hesitating when it comes to taking out the aliens. Now that we have recovered one of Dr. Valen's test subjects, I can begin an autopsy on the specimen as soon as you give the order, Command. Another impressive effort, Commander. My expectations were Dark high, event countered? Avatar Project them. Major Breakthrough. Thank God I decided to do the hidden event. We have a bunch more supplies, which I probably wanted to use somewhere. Now I can't remember. I think plasma grenade. I think we may. Oh right. I'm gonna make another spark. I'll send word as soon as we're finished. Please. And then that. And. I think I'll just sit for that for now. That's a number of days, so. New orders, Commander? Mebbe. I'll go ahead and enhance the Shadow Keeper. Still 207 supplies. Awesome. I've had a chance to take a closer look at some of the advent weapons recovered from the field. The alloy used in their frames is significantly lighter, making them more suited to the human form. I'm guessing it's the same material we've seen them using all over the colonies, but they'd have to be producing it from something here on Earth. They seem to have an endless supply of this stuff. Pick up another one of my friends. Oh, wow, that's a lot. All right, well. Not so much of that idea. All right. Now, you can go in for your second skill. Defilade, plus five bonus to defense provided by cover. Oddly enough, I've come to like the passive abilities of the leaders a lot more than the active ones, by and large. Oh, I guess I can't look at it again, but... I don't know, I, th I think it's just because you always get them, and a lot of times I need my leader to, you know, shoot things or some other stuff like that. God. Yes, I, I, I want to, but <laughs> I have so much other stuff course. I'm trying to do. I think I could have predicted this outcome. 
Though it is in The aliens aren't going to be happy when they see we've got energy weapons just like theirs now. Lots of upgrades available. Oh, oh man, I kind of really want that. Okay. Oh, Berserker Queen, Berserker Queen. The most dangerous of my three test subjects. The Berserker Queen also represents the greatest leap towards the boundaries of what could be considered reasonable and ethical research. Even in wartime, I must consider the fact that by providing an already unstable alien being with equipment that may further its own capabilities, I risk crossing a line that can never be uncrossed. I, I think that you cross that line when you start the whole project. Apparently my predecessor was something of a brute when it came to handling the interrogation and autopsy of alien subjects. From what I've heard, she was keen to get her hands dirty whenever possible. Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. Yeah, I was afraid of that. All right, start saving up those supplies again. No lance. Oh, jeez. Um, soul steel. Let's uh, let him heal when he uses soul fire. Oh, thank goodness. That's gonna be a huge benefit. I need advanced explosives now. Yeah, I need to do that too. Man, too much stuff to do. Strategic resource located. Alright, got that. Oh my gosh. Wait. Wasn't that the same one that I revealed before? Oh well. Scientist. Avenger plotting new course. I am sure you will find the results to be as intriguing as I do, Commander. As Dr. Valen noted in her own report, it was irresponsible and borderline irrational for her to have pursued this research, knowing the incredible risks involved, not just to herself, but to what little of humanity as a whole remains. This fearsome creature, long referred to as a berserker, not quite as terrifying as the Queen variant, I guess, but uh, still, they're not very nice. I appreciate the new lab facilities, Commander. Okay, so that'll help. That can spin down my uh, research times a little bit more. Once I get the... Laboratory facility upgraded. Yes. Yes. And that's only three days. I'm not going to save much there, so let's go ahead and get started on this one. I keep doing that. I keep forgetting to hit the button. Anyway, alright, so I still need to have a bunch of upgrades I need to accomplish. It's gonna just come down to the supplies, I think. All right, you are going to be able to go on missions now. The nice thing about psyops is that they continue, tr like they'll just as long as they're not wounded, they'll just keep training. Like you send them on a mission, and then they come back and they just go back in the training. You don't have to take them out of training to use them. Stasis is actually kind of useful on occasion. Can take an enemy out of the fight briefly for a turn. Hey, 
another scientist, and Intel. Extract VIP from Advent City. All right, so we've got our next mission, Operation Buried Tome. This will be down in India, and we are going to get, like I said, a scientist of the Intel. That'll be next time. But until then, my name has been Anthiar. This has been XCOM 2 with Shen's Last Gift and the Alien Hunters DLC. We managed to take out the Berserker Queen, leaving only the Archon King remaining. I hope to see everybody again soon for Operation Buried Tome, but until then, take care. <laughs>